The former president, Mohamed Buhari, blamed the past government for Nigerian heroes. Now he's avoiding proof. The former lawmaker, Shehu Sani. According to the former Kaduna senator, Buhari is allergic to being scrutinized and blamed after doing the same to his presidential good luck, Jonathan. Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Nigerians, a former federal lawmaker and social critic, Shehu Sani has condemned Nigerian immediate past president Muhammad Buhari for pleading with the present government of Bola Tinubu not to prove him and his aid for the calamities they did to Nigerians during the period of eight years after their administration. According to the former lawmaker, Senator, according to the former Kaduna Senator, Wari is allergic to being scrutinized and blamed after doing the same to his presidential good luck Jonathan. Noting how Buhari blamed the previous government for Nigerians' issues while in office. They arrogantly oppressed, dispossessed, and killed the poor and the innocent, and without remorse, they seek divine blessings for their injustice and inequity. Buhari proved and blamed all the hues and viruses of, the, of this country on the previous administrations but he is allergic to being pro and blamed, Sanu wrote on Twitter. It was earlier reported that President Bola Tinubu had assured his presidential, Muhammad Buhari, that he and his close aide would not be spared, would be spared in any anti-corruption war his government engaged in. Sahara reporters learned on Tuesday that this was discussed during the meeting between Tinubu and Buhari in London, United Kingdom, on Monday night. The government's assurance to this, to his procedure, comes amid repeated and ongoing moves by the secret police, the Department of State Service, to place a lead on further investigation of politically exposed persons by the anti-corruption body, the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. Already, the DSS has carried out raids on the EFCC office in Lagos and Abuja, capturing away sensitive files, documents, and flash drives on investigations into alleged fraudulent activities of former governors, senators, and ministers, Sahara reporters have learned. You see, it's not being clear. The reason why the EFCC has been arrested or has been, you know, uh, suspended, definitely. So you see, who said Tunubu's government is sent? Nigerians will never say anything. This is just the beginning. You cannot tell us that you are fighting corruption and you are leaving the main subject here. President Mohamed Buhari is the one in the center. So if you want to, you know, pursue anybody, first of all, you trace Buhari. Now you are assuring Buhari you will not investigate him. Why? You will not investigate his aid. You are now investigating those you feel that you have personal issues with. Nigerians should wake up and forget about this tribalism that is killing us. This is really killing us. Nigeria is not moving forward because of the way we think. Now, my brother. So whatever he does is not the issue. After all, a uh, Hausa man was there, and what about it? Nigeria is going down every day by day, and all of them they look, when they clap, when they fight on social media. This is not a joke. President Muhammad Buhari caused harm to this country. That is the, that is even the 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 more reason why they did what they did in the election because they don't want to be exposed. Make you now watch this, this uh, suspicion and the arrest by the DSS. I go go. Make you now just watch this matter. From now to six months' time or four months' time, this matter goes silent. This is the initial igrigri. Then they do. Uh -huh. just, just to, you know, 
and uh, deceive gullible people. Say then they work. Me, I never want to talk anything because I never see anything. Life has become more difficult since the day one this government enter office. So what I want to talk. If you feel say you want uh you want you want proof people, you want to fight corruption, do one in a way that people don't go ask questions, you understand? Now during uh, the former uh, president, uh, President Muhammad Buhari Steno, now so he blamed Good Luck Jonathan till the day he, he left office. Till the very day he left office, everything he did was caused by Good Luck Jonathan. Now he don't they beg, made an approval. And so who is now fit to be proved? Nigeria matter not will end today. The only way this matter would have ended is. If another uh, party assume office, and that is why this government, you know, really fought for, you understand, Nigerians, there is fire on the mountain. He has not left his poor Castina people and Nigerians at their own mercy now, relaxing in London with his family, get sense, die hard supporters. This is the reason Tunubu was rigged. In so that he will not prove him, Peter will be we prove him. True, this is the man who arrogantly called a man of integrity. Ha! Question is who then won't make a proper hurry? Now the past government, nothing is permanent in this life. Oh, they rigged the bull in for for the cover of of these reasons. Okay, guys, these are some reactions you know from Nigerians. I'm dropping it. Uh, kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you.